The third expansion for Battlefield 1, Turning Tides, has been detailed ahead of its upcoming release. The DLC will be released in two waves, according to AA, which says the first will be arriving in December and the other in January. Anyone with the game's premium pass will get the drops two weeks ahead of everyone else, which includes anyone who picks up the pass before the DLC arrives. The first of the two DLC releases will be the biggest of the bunch, bringing the new maps Baba and Capellas, as well as the Operation Gallipoli, half a dozen new guns, a pair of new melee weapons, as well as an Infiltrator Elite class, a new L-class destroyer, and a new C-class airship. The new firearms are listed below M1917 Trench Carbine Machine and Pistoli M1912 P.16 Farquhar Hill M1917 MG Carcano M91 Carbine Type 38 Arasaka The two maps mentioned above will be joined by yet another two maps in the second DLC release for Turning Tides, and they'll be called Heligol and Bite and Zebru G. The only other part of the second drop will be the addition of the British Army's Royal Marines, including the blue uniform found on the British Empire's naval troops. Following with that, the two maps arriving in January will both focus on the British troops in some way, with Heligol and Veidt focusing on a clash between the Royal Marines and the German Navy, while the second map, Zeebrugge, will focus on the British raid of Brugge Brugge. The Baba map arriving in December will focus on the British assault of 1915 on Gallipoli Peninsula, with AI describing it as infantry-focused. The Cape Hellas map, meanwhile, will have players either serving as British troops storming Gallipoli's beaches or defending the Ottoman Empire. Source Battlefield 1